iPhone in 2019 when I just recently sold my iPhone 10 um, to replace it with a, an Android phone and uh, that's a good enough question to ask and it's one I'm going to uh, try and answer uh, you right now hopefully so this is the iPhone SE came out 2016 uh, this spec wise for this one is 32 GB has 2 GB of RAM 4 inch uh, screen which is uh, uh, iPhone retina screen and according to GSM Arena is uh, 640 by 1136 uh, resolution. It's pretty good. In fact, uh, it's all uh, all. I, I think all iPhone from iPhone 4 upwards, uh, iPhone 5, um, iPhone 5s, etc. I think they had really good screens, albeit quite small. Four inches is quite small. Has a Touch ID. Has Apple Pay. Have a good camera, and the camera I think is 12. And a um, 12 megapixel with dual flash and a 1.2 megapixel uh, front facing camera. Uh, I got this from eBay. It was described as, I think, B condition, uh, and I got it for, I think it was 80 something pa uh, dollars. And when it came, I mean, it's not a mark on it. I mean, you might see some. Uh, there was a sticker on here, that's why there's uh, some marks there, and my kid has been with his grubby fingers watching YouTube on it, um, but really, it looked absolutely brand spanking new. So, uh, the first thing I did immediately was I upgraded it to uh, iOS 13, which is on to, I think, iOS 13.2. Now, for people who know about iPhones, the iPhone SE or Special Edition have the same specification, I believe, as the iPhone 6S, uh, just in the iPhone 5 body. And you know, a lot of people really like this phone, and there is talk, there is hope by people that they're going to release iPhone SE 2, and I, I think there's definitely a market for it. Uh, um, I think I like it. I, I like the look of it. I've enjoyed it. Um, but why did I buy it? Okay, well, uh, there's one simple reason why I bought it. And that reason, hold on, if I can show you here, is on my wrist, is, yes, my Apple Watch. Now, you can, you can use your Apple Watch without an iPhone, uh, but you're only going to get the most basic uh, uses out of it. Uh, you really need a iPhone, especially if you want to update it to the latest watch OS, uh, which I ha which is the reason I, I I bought it. I thought I could do it with my wife's iPhone, which I could have done. I linked it to hers, but then I would be getting all her notifications, etc., on on mine. So. Uh, I, so I didn't want that, of course, uh, but I wanted to update the Apple Watch 4, the Series 4 that I have, and this was the most um, budget-conscious solution uh, that I that I could find, and it's done the job uh, perfectly. And I've, I think it's a, just a really good wee phone to have now. For people who are Android guys like me, uh, but still, you know, I'm not anti Apple per se. I, I, I'm, I, you know, uh, I've got the you know, mixed feelings here and there. But for eighty, eighty dollars, eighty pounds, whatever that is, uh, seventy-five pounds, whatever that is, um, uh, you know, if you really wanted to get into the a second phone and have an Apple into the Apple ecosystem with some of their good apps and I'll tell you one of them in a minute um, which I miss on Android because it doesn't have it this might be you know a, 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 an answer for you uh, of course it can I don't have a sim card in here so it uh, it it doubles as a kind of uh, a, a bit of a media uh, device and it's got an absolutely brilliant camera and even the video is pretty good. The only thing I would say that I've noticed, um, the microphones on, and I've made some videos, review videos on this, I noticed that the microphone was a bit uh, quiet. Um, 
and that could easily be um, you just take uh, an external mic, which I have and I tried and it didn't seem to work, but that could be me. Anyway, um, and the other thing that I've noticed, now I, it's hard to, to see if there's really anything uh, going on with this, but sometimes with the Wi-Fi I notice it's a bit can be a bit slow, but that may just, it's not always. Uh, sometimes when you're opening, uh, like YouTube, it will say that it's not connected when it clearly is connected and then you click again, try again and then it opens but um, apart from that uh, I've um, not really had any uh, issues whatsoever with it and the great thing with having a small, such a small package is that uh, you get iMovie which is really easy for doing videos and you know I like to do my videos on the cheap uh, and Unfortunately, you do always hear my very loud uh, jet engine AC, but what can I do about that? Uh, um, so iMovie is really easy for just uh, using. And this, well, there we go. And the other thing I was going to say about this is very tough. Compared to the, the latest iPhones, I mean, you could drop this baby and uh, it, it's, it's very, very tough. And the, the, the good thing about this is it's quite cheap to replace these uh, screens. Um, uh, that is one of the good things about these uh, Apple phones. That not the from the X upwards, shall we say, or from the iPhone 10 upwards. These are really pretty easy to replace up until five five S, I suppose it's called. Um, now uh, the app that I really missed whilst I was. Uh, well, I'm back in my Android world. Is this app here? Can you see it? It's called uh, Chuck. Now, Chuck is, uh, I think you get a free version of it, but I, I've got the subscription to it. Now, Chuck is uh, an app that allows you to uh, batch bulk delete uh, emails. Um, and so if you're lazy like me and never bother to kind of go through your uh, emails and all the crap that you get, um, this is very easy to, to use. And you can see that I've got there one 1,200 and something, and I've just went and deleted probably about that much uh, about five minutes ago. So th this makes it um, a lot easier. And I haven't seen Chuck on Android. Now, I'm not saying that there's not another type of app on Android that does a uh, similar kind of job as Chuck but as I'd had this subscription from the iPhone 10 then uh, it, it just um, it was a no-brainer and the other thing that <coughs> that I missed um, is because I had a subscription uh, or I had bought uh, some pack packs was the action movie app which is pretty fun this is by uh, Bad Robot which uh, is a photo uh, which is a film studio um, some of these uh, if you don't have <laughs> some of these on your phone you should uh, download they're pr quite fun uh, to especially when you have kids uh, to do some special effect video uh, short videos so I, I kind of missed that and of course the main reason uh, was for uh, Raymond's watch so that allows me to uh, um, control everything uh, about um, my Apple Watch, my Apple Series 4 watch, so that was the main reason. Now, I haven't put any music on here because I've been lazy to do it, but I'm also going to put some uh, music on it, so it kind of makes that, uh, I can use that for, uh, uh, of course, uh, Bluetooth music to my earphones, etc. Uh, and although it's only 32 GB, I'm, I don't want to fill it up, but you can get a good decent amount of uh, uh, songs on that, so that was an, uh, another reason as well to keep it. And I, I, look, it's the price. I don't need to put a sim on it. Um, it is performing all these functions that I need it to do without having a sim uh, card inside it, which, by the way, is a, a nano sim. Uh, now the last. I never owned an iPhone 5 or an iPhone 5S. The last iPhone I had before iPhone 10 was an iPhone 4S, which was slightly smaller than this, I believe, but this has a slightly bigger um, screen. But when you're coming from bigger phones, even the iPhone 10 and, and, and other Android phones, of course, 
the screen seems pretty small. Uh, it, although it's a brilliant panel, it does seem pretty small, and my eyes really are not as uh, sharp, shall we say, as they once were. I have to excuse me in my voice. I have a bit of a cold given to me by my two-year-old. Uh, thanks, Isaac. Um, uh, so the screen, okay, it's, it's small, but generally, <coughs> excuse me, I have to, there's some things I have to put my um, glasses on, and I find in, I'm finding these days that I'm using my glasses more and more, even for the bigger screen, so uh, what can you do? Old age, they say old age, it doesn't come alone, and they're right. So this was the silver version which I think looks really uh, uh, very cool it feels great in the hand uh, it's just a nice wee phone to have um, especially for me who I need some Apple stuff and um, I'm, I'm, I don't want to go back to having a iPhone as my uh, my main uh, you know daily uh, phone uh, recently I bought my wife the iPhone 11 Pro and yeah sure it's a nice phone and it's a great screen the iPhone the biggest one I think it's the Pro Plus or something it's called I'm not sure um, the exact name of it it costs a lot of money um, yeah the screen is great everything's good good cameras etc but I've, you know I'm I miss certain things with Android and uh, file management downloading etc there was just a lot of stuff that I really missed and I and although it's getting slightly better in uh, iOS, uh, and especially I suppose from the iOS uh, or the Pados OS for iPad, it's getting more uh, easier for control of certain file management, etc. But it's still not that good. And I don't. So um, sorry about that. My um, uh, I don't know what happened with my phone there. Um, so yeah. Um, iPhone 11, blah blah. It's uh, a, a nice phone, but uh, and uh, I, I like the new iPad, etc. But really, uh, it's Android for me, just because of these uh, things that I need, um, especially when we're looking at uh, downloading, uh, etc. And by downloading, um, I mean um, torrents, stuff like that. Okay, so um, Android is king when it's compared to that. Uh, but <clears throat> the reason I'm doing this um, quick piece for you is that you might be like me one and I, look the Apple Watch bar none. I mean the battery on here is great two days so you you might want to own a uh, Apple Watch I think it's up to number five now the Apple Watch five although I would if it, it, you, uh, look for me the difference between four and five. I think uh, I would still go with four. The five, the ma main big difference is kind of always on uh, display, uh, but uh, I I'm certainly not interested to upgrade to five. But maybe six, when the, the the six series comes along, I might be I might be more interested. Let's see what happens. Wait, if the battery life is better, definitely. But you know, I I think, and I've used a lot of um, Android, oh, uh, Android Wear um, smart watches, which I liked, but. I still think this is the best uh, smartwatch out there for the things that we need to monitor, health, uh, exercise, notifications, that kind of thing. I just still think it is the best uh, smartwatch, in my opinion. Okay, so if you want that, you do need to have a uh, iOS device and you can't uh, operate the you can't use an iPad because the watch app is not available on uh, for uh, for an iPad. I thought originally that's what I could do, and then of course I, I couldn't. So hence buying this. So for people who are interested, then it is worth it. It's not spending a lot of money. It's still a good phone. It's up to the latest um, uh, iOS 13, um, and that's going to last you a year or two. Actually, and speed-wise, even though the this got an A9. 
uh, uh, processor. I think I think is dual core and two GB of RAM, and it's still pretty good. Um, I, well, I haven't noticed any um, real issues with it. As I said, the camera's still re uh, really good. So this could be your secondary uh, device. Um, your music player, your iPod, you know, get a 64 GB, 128 GB version. You, you know, this could be your music library and also the control for your uh, Apple Watch and um, certain other things. You can, uh, of course, there's Apple TV. And for those who aren't aware of the Apple TV, is that it's it's a new streaming service. So, and I think it's like um, we pay here twenty reals a month. I think it is. So, which what is that? Like less than I don't know, three four pounds something. Um, and you then have access to the great show, which is called C, which has Carl Drogo from Game of Thrones. Um, Aquaman, that guy, Big Jason, uh, is a brilliant show. Uh, that's on Apple TV. You have another really creepy show called Servant, which is um, on Apple TV, which is new. And uh, there are other shows as well. But these are these are really two standout shows. So you can use your small, um, perfectly formed iPhone SE and uh, cast to your. Uh, well, I'm just cast into my Samsung. Uh, I have a Samsung Smart TV. It worked fine. No problems at all. Um, well, when I say no problems at all, there was some problems, but I eventually it worked out how to do it. Uh, but if your TV has AirPlay, easiest uh, option, then you cast and uh, you can benefit from uh, Apple TV as well. And it's only going to get better in the coming months, I have no doubt. So... Um, there's a lot of reasons that you could own this and not use it as your daily phone if you're still an Android person like me. And in 2019, uh, I think that it's still a viable proposition. And it could be your main phone. It does everything. If your eyes are better than mine, then it, it really it does everything that you want. And if you're not uh, too bothered about the, the, the things that I need, and as I say, you're... Um, Male or female with an Apple uh, Watch, I think it's uh, definitely worthwhile considering, especially when uh, you look at the prices of the latest iPhones, etc. Um, and especially if you were using this as a secondary device, why spend all that money when this is doing it? Now, the argument might be made that it might not get an update of iOS 14. Well, I, I, to be honest with you, I don't mind. It'll last a couple of years on iOS 13 for me. and. Who knows by then what the Apple Watch will be doing. So um, certainly for this year and next, I think it will be uh, more than enough uh, for my needs. So that's all I wanted to say. That's what I wanted to share. Um, I hope that uh, it would help anybody um, thinking that they wanted to spend not too much money and get a nice wee phone to hold in your big hand. So that's it. Questions, etc. I'll do my best. I'm not promising. Um, that's it. iPhone SE. Bye.